the only game in the nation for a two-hour stretch. The Grizzlies have the national spotlight, looking to pull off a major upset against a Pac-12 opponent. By Stegman, swinging around with under 10 to shoot. Whitney puts it through. Hey, Roberts wants it inside. Deflected, nice play by Vasquez. Vasquez throws over to Cam Parker in the corner. No look pass, Owens off the window and good. And that's off an assist from Cameron Parker. No surprise there. One of the best assist men in the NCAA. You can make that. Parker. Quick touch, Owens. Cries of defense to the more engaged team early on in an offensive foul. Kyle Owens will stand in there. Cameron Parker's penetration has been a problem for the Huskies so far. Grizzlies on a bit of a run. They're doubling up the Huskies here tonight. Well, they're digging a hole right now. Stedman will take a mid-range jumper, and the lead has been built to 10. Kyle Owens just out-hustled the Huskies on that play. Got in and got that offensive rebound. Excellent defense by Brandon Whitney. That's a freshman going up against a senior in green. Former McDonald's All-American. This is a good defensive team. Very sound man-to-man -man defense. That's been the trademark for Travis DeCure's teams. Another turnover for the Huskies. Oh, the turnovers continue to mount for the Huskies. Vasquez takes a three over Quade Green and flushes it. And an up and under, and the Grizz answer again. It's hard to second guess anything he's doing right now. They've got UW almost doubled here in the first half. The lob deflected, turnover. Over to Owens, through contact, off the window, no. Tip back good from Josh Bannon. Fryer. Driving stripped. Brandon Whitney, good penetration. They have some impressive young guards. Quick touch pass. Owens off the glass, finishes. Sedman turns and faces the basket, kicks back to his point guard. Parker through contact, off the glass and good. And Parker finishes. 8 nothing run for the dogs. Suddenly within three. Zorn, boy, he has been everything for the Huskies the last couple of minutes. Here comes Raekwon, battle to finish at the rim. This game is now tied with under seven to play. With 4.36 on the clock for Washington, it's their first lead since it was five to four. We're finding Whitney, active zone here for Washington. They'll feed the post and Owens, outside Vasquez, right wing three, up and in. And Montana goes back in front, 54 to 53. Well, that's a good kick out right there. That is a high arching shot. Grizzlies are so close to pulling it off. Can they finish? Whitney open, three on the way. It is up and good. And Montana reaches out to a six point lead. 59 to 53. That's against runner over sword off the window. It's a 10 to nothing run. And the lead is stretched to eight. 61 to 53. All right, just throws up a Hail Mary. What a performance tonight for Montana. Sahonis goes through contact, misses the shot, rebound by Josh Bannon. Bannon will get it to Josh Vasquez. He breaks the pressure into the front court and will dribble this one out. And for the first time in 26 years, the Montana Grizzlies have knocked off the Washington Huskies. And they snap a 14-game losing streak to Pac-12 opponents as they pull off the upset tonight by a final score of 60. 56 to 58, Travis DeCure comes home. And after so many opportunities where the Grizzlies were so close to an upset. But I knew I knew for a fact when I looked in the mirror that morning when I woke up that I, I could have been better in both of those games and we should have won those games. And so I was just, you know, just give me one more shot. Give me one more shot. We're, we're in striking distance down the stretch and I'll be solid. And, and we were an efficient basketball team tonight and that's what you have to be to win these type of games. I don't know who came in here and kept it. Hey, it's one, two, three. Yeah.